physical impulses and everything else. So, you know, meet a beautiful woman. Uh, you know what I mean by that. Um, you know, go clubbing, drink alcohol. Basically, the modern idea of having fun. And uh, yeah, play some video games. So I, I, I enjoyed that too. But hey. Hello, you. This is Ciprian G at the present and precise moment of 5.33, 10 January 2018, documenting the step number 21 for the book From the Book Steps to Knowledge, channeled by Marshall Vian Summer. So, step number 21. Step number 21, it's a review. Uh, the key words are review the lessons of past week, results, not making any conclusion, simply recognize the development and note the progress. It's a 145 minute practice and uh, I have did it on the day of 9-01-2018, which is yesterday compared to today. So yeah, here in this step, I will take the steps from number 15 until step number 21 and, uh, you know, give a little description of what happened during those steps. So, hey, this is like the review of week, week, week three. Step number 15. This was done on the 30. December 2017 and it's one 45 minutes practice and the name is I shall listen to my experience today. As of now I believe that the true content of my current context in life is to openly share the contents of my mind with the external aspect of our subconscious, the internet. The impulses and wishes that I feel are to meet many beautiful women, go clubbing, drink alcohol and maybe play video games. Step number 15 is where we should recognize what is true of us, what is our true destination and what is, you know, our physical animalistic impulses. And for me, it's to you know, basically be a blogger and I guess talk about myself, not myself, talk about my experiences, perspectives, how I view life and things like that, I guess. And uh, the impulses, I mean the physical impulses and everything are so, you know, meet a beautiful woman, uh, you know what I mean by that. Um, you know, go clubbing, drink alcohol, basically the modern idea of having fun and uh, yeah, play some video games, so I, I, I enjoy that too, but hey, I'm trying to keep it low so that I follow my true purpose in life. Yeah, that was step number 15. Step number 16, beyond my mind is knowledge. This was done on... Uh, 31 December 2017 and also on uh, 2 January 2018 it's a 3 15 minutes practice and uh, yeah this has been on done on Tuesdays because from like 30 December until like 2 or 3 January I've been listening to my impulses so to say <laughs> I've been I've been partying for some three or four straight days. That's what it was quite nice, you know. But hey, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> okay, this is where I am clearly conscious aware of my initiation into a higher way of perceiving life, and that is true. I am currently in the process of stepping from the third dimensional view into the fourth dimensional view and there's a lot to talk about that 
where I clearly understand that I must not condemn myself for that which I have allowed in my own life, but to forgive myself and move further by means of the newly acquired knowledge. So I shouldn't give my shell my <laughs> I shouldn't give myself shit for what I have created in the past because I was at a limit of, limited point of focus and consciousness. So instead, I should understand what happened, that I was there, but now I am here and from now on I will create only that which I want to create. Because I now know how creation works, basically. Step number 17. Today, I want to hear the truth. It was done uh, also on the 12th, on the 2nd January 2018, 3 15 minutes practice. And today, I want to hear the truth. This is where I, I was perceiving myself in a dark place because I had been partying from, for some three nights straight, so I was kind of disregarding my practices, my discipline. And that was the truth of that moment. As I've said, you know, after you party for a while and uh, you disregard your discipline, you disregard the, that which you feel that you want to do and that, that which you really want to do with your life, uh, then you you might feel a little bit bad about it and you know that was the truth of that moment for me so that's what I wrote step number 18 today I feel the truth arising within myself this was also done on the 2nd January 2018 but this wasn't done in the at 4 a.m. in the morning this was done at at uh, three, at some other point, I don't know. The main truth that I perceive at that moment, the main truth that I perceived at that moment was that there still is fear inside of me. Although I have many wonderful ideas, fear is acting as resistance and is slowing down my process of growth. Yep, I speak about this in my recent posts and it is true, I recognize it, I'm aware of it and I will, I am doing my best to outgrow that fear. Although I say and think that I do not fear judgment, the opposite seems still, seems to still be true for now. Hey. We say things, but it's not always true. We, you know, we have to recognize that and get back at them, move past them. Step number 19. Today, I wish to see. Step number 19 was done on a lot of days, on uh, the 3rd, on the 5th, and on the 6th. It seems that I skipped the 4th entirely. For some reason, I do not remember. But uh, yeah, I stayed with this practice quite a while because I wanted to do well. This is where I first started like the gazing into the object practice. And since I really thought it was a necessary, meaningful practice, I didn't want to just do it like that and skip over it. I wanted to stay with it until I have felt that I have done it well. This is where I first got the great idea of doing a live meditation practice. Yeah, maybe on, you know, like a live stream on your thought. As of now, I still seem afraid to start it, but I am working towards it. You know, I think it's a really great idea and I think I should, I should do it, but there, there is some resistance, like fear inside me of doing it for some fucking reason. I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, as I said, I'm convincing myself into doing it. So stay tuned. Wait for it. Step number 20. I will not let doubt and confusion slow my progress. This was done on 8th. January 2018 
and it took two 15 minutes practice. The truth is that I've been letting doubts and confusion slow, slow down my progress. This exercise made me become even more aware of that, which is of great help in overcoming these unwanted traits within myself. Yeah, as I've said, <laughs> this uh, I, I've recognized this even some steps behind this, you know. Uh, so yeah, man, that there really seems to be like a connection, like some steps. I even perceive them before actually doing them. It's 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 like a fucking process. I'm, whew, it's really interesting. And step number twenty one the one which I'm doing right now and it's a review done on the 9th 01 2018 and it's a one one 45 minute practice and uh, this can be taken as the general perspective of it and uh, yeah this has been a hard week because of how much I went off road well it has been more than a week but yeah you could call it a week this has been a hard week because of how much I went off-road from the main journey. But in the end I came back onto the journey and that confirms to me that this really is something that I want to do. And something I'm serious about. Also, this week's exercises made me become so much more aware of which habits I should keep giving attention to and to which not it is true i mean clubbing beautiful ladies and all these kind of things maybe i should put them on the side of things for a while not as main priority but hey maybe engage with them sometimes but not as much as i have done in the past because i'd like I have like other goals with my life right now. It has also been a hard week because I had to recognize within myself those traits that I perceive unwanted and want to get rid of, like confusion, indecision, doubts, fear, and lust for women. Women. I don't know. Yeah. So yeah, as I said, it's been uh, it's been quite a week because it has been like the New Year's Eve, and uh, it's been more than a week. In fact, it was like even more than ten days. It was like fucking eleven days. Almost two weeks because yeah, I wanted to do it well, and I didn't really want to skip. And uh, it's been some days that I've been really down and mad at myself for you know putting out of other priorities over this series and everything but hey i'm now back on track with it so i'm grateful for that you know maybe it was just a test to see if i'm i, I really want to do it or not and i really want to do it so i will keep a bit and uh, yeah this has been like week three from the book steps to knowledge and uh Man, I really didn't think I would benefit of it so much. It's it's been like a fucking great journey so far, and it, I'm 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 just into the third week of it. So that's that's crazy. Uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to what's come to what's 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 to come next. And uh, hey, I'm glad I'm doing it, and I'm glad I'm doing it. Not only for myself, but for whoever decides to watch it. And uh, yeah. This has been Chip Renji with the review of week number three, step number 21. And uh, I'm closing this video at the present and precise moment of 5.48 p.m. on the 10th January 2018 I thank you very much for watching I'm glad that you are watching and hey 
watch some more if you like it. I mean, why not? You know, you like them, you watch some more. It's easy, it's basic logic. Thank you again, and hey, Cheaper NG is out. Yeah. Baby! Cheaper NG, Cruciata Dam. What about some other shits that we can do? Why don't we do that?